This is the romance of steam power railroading. The sights and sounds that stir the blood of railroad buffs. The Eureka Springs Railroad crossing the White River Bridge at Beaver, Arkansas. This is the pleasure, the excitement. And this is the work, the seemingly never-ending work of keeping an old steam locomotive chugging. It's a constant job to maintain. You spend more than you would like working on them? Oh, I like to work on them. Sometimes you wish you could just run them, but then it's just a constant repair. Reed Younger knows both the romance and the reality of railroading. He spent 10 years of his retirement rebuilding and operating his railroad. It's been in the Younger's blood for generations. Reed's father worked on the original Eureka Springs Railroad before it went broke decades ago, and Reed and his brother grew up playing with trains. We had a little model railroad, O-Gage, and it was, um, we built track and built track. Finally, my brother, Dreet, he said, so we ought to get something that we can ride on. And every time I come down here, I tell him this is ridiculous, the standard gauge railway. <laughs> but that's why we got into it, so we could ride on something. Now Reed's son works as conductor on his dad's railroad, telling the stories, the history, to the tourists who follow the sound of the whistle. They've got a mile and a half a track, and they spent a quarter of a million dollars. There have been good years and bad, times when money was short, investors were wary. But a boost came when Hollywood came to Beaver, Arkansas, using the train for scenes in the television miniseries on the Civil War, a movie called The Blue and the Gray. And then there's a competition, just a few miles south in Eureka Springs, another steam excursion train, the Eureka Springs and North Arkansas, a well-financed operation, a competitor that's both helped and hurt, Younger says. You ever get to the point where you think it's just not worth it? Oh, no, no, I'd rather be doing this than anything. Sometimes it gets discouraging. But he says that's railroading, the fun, the worries, the excitement of live steam, and the work of hot metal. The stuff that flows in the blood of men like Reed Younger. We're running steam trains. That's the thing. Taking tours don't ride. That's the best thing. We're in business, in other words. Ed Filmer, Action News, Beaver, Arkansas.